Good day, everyone. I am Teacher Ami, your Matinic teacher, and this is Mathematics 4. Today marks a new episode of our Math Amazing Adventure. And so, brace yourself and prepare your pen, paper, and your math learning materials as we will start right away our math amazing adventure. Before anything else, let's have first our drill or review. You may write your answer on your paper. I will be giving you one minute to answer this activity. Are you ready? On the count of three, you may start answering. One, two, three. Encircle the prime numbers and box the composite numbers. We have numbers 15, 16, 17, 18, and 19. Right, time's up. Let's now check your answers. The prime numbers are 17 and 19. While the composite numbers are 15, 16, and 18. So, what's your score, students? As you see, our topic for today is about prime and composite numbers. In this lesson, you will enjoy working with numbers, especially on prime and composite numbers. What do you think does prime number mean? Very good! Yes, prime number is a number with only two factors, one and itself. We say, for example, number two. The factors of number two are one and two only because these are the only numbers to be multiplied to get the product two. Same with the other prime numbers. Let's have number three. The factors of 3 are only 1 and 3 because these again are the only numbers to multiply to get the product 3. Let's have 5. The factors of 5 are only 1 and 5 because 1 and 5 are the only numbers we multiply to get the product 5. On the other hand, composite numbers are numbers with three or more factors. We say, for example, number 4. The factors of number 4 are 1 times 4 and 2 times 2. Then, we arrange the factors in increasing order. So we have 1, 2, and 4. You will notice 
that we use number two only once. So there you go. We have three factors for the number four. Same with the other composite numbers. Let's have six. The factors of number six are one times six, two times three. For these are the only factors to arrive at the product six. Then we arrange the factors in increasing order. So we have one, two, three, and six. Let's have one more number. What about 12? Three. only. Now, what are the composite numbers? So, we have 45 and 96. For 45, the factors of it are 1, 3, 5, 9, 15, and 45. And for 96, the factors are 1, 2, 3, 4, 6, 8, 12, 16, 24, 32, 48, and 96. And this makes 45 and 96 composite numbers. 
What score did you get? Mathematics students. Wow! Very good. I am very happy that you learned a lot in our discussion today. This time, to deepen more your understanding about prime and composite numbers, as an assignment, write in a one whole sheet of paper the first five prime numbers and also the first five composite numbers. I would like you to pass this with your self-learning materials at the end of this week. That's all, Mathenic students. I really enjoyed our math amazing learning and adventure. You may also share this video with your family and friends so that everybody can become Mathenic like you 